Hype, Hype, Hype. I believe we've come to the end of season one and season one has been absolutely amazing in Bekwe today. All right, so my name is Mr. Tourism. I'm going to allow Mr. Property to take over from here. So he will show you to the two properties that we have in Bekwe. And then when he's done, I'm going to take over and we're going to have a little talk. So Mr. Property, talk to the people. All right, so this is the season finale. We had to do it big episode 10. Can't believe we've come to the end of season one. And season one has been absolutely amazing. Everywhere we go in St. Vincent, everybody saying, Mr. Property! I come down back with the gentleman right behind right me. So, Mr. Property, I'm to come talk to him after, the, after we done start the video. So, we're in Beckway. We're going to be checking out two properties in Beckway. One, a potential villa opportunity. And two, a lovely piece of land up in Crown Point. So, the first one, we're going Friendship. Check out this property. And then we're going to Crown Point to check out this excellent property. All right, so come with us as we go through Beckway, we talk about Beckway, and we tell you about these awesome real estate options. All right, so I came down to Beckway, I parked my vehicle, I start the video. The man said, Mr. Property! This Mr. Is property! So this is Mr. Patterson, right? Yes. All right, so where do you know we from? Where do you know we from? Tell the people. Facebook them. and selling properties. Facebook and selling is. properties. We think about the video then. Excellent, excellent promotion. Come on, no, if you have a sale, please contact Mr. Property. Come on, I want to have a taxi. What is the taxi? Okay, you taxi number, no man. Cortis taxi. What is the taxi name? Cortis taxi. Courtly Cortis. Cortis taxi. So if you come down to Beckway and you want a taxi, you come check Mr. Patterson and organize yourself. You have a phone number? Come, look at the phone number. So call before you come down. Because the man does watch Mr. Property videos. <laughs> Alright, so we're in Beckway. We're going to check out some property. And we're going to see two lovely property options. There we go. Alright, so how could I not tell you a little, a little something about Beckway before we head off to these two properties? So, St. Vincent, as I told you in episode 8, St. Vincent is one of the best islands in the Caribbean. And I don't take that back for nothing. Not only have we have the mainland St. Vincent, we have 32 islands and keys. And Bekwe happens to be the biggest of those Venetian islands. Seven square miles, about 5,000 people living on the island. It's a nice place for real estate also because a lot of people choose to retire in Bekwe. A lot of people come on a cruise ship and they come down to the, the, the Grenadines and they say, yo, I need to buy a piece of this island because it is really nice. So, Real estate is nice in, in, in Beckway because that is a lovely destination for people. St. Vincent is the bigger island, it's a bit more crowded, but Beckway is the perfect, the little perfect getaway. So you have that island tropical vibe. The ex, you know, far from people kind of vibes too. The white sand, the nice friendly people. And if there's one thing about Beckway people, let me have to say it right now. Beckway people, the business minded. So they're the, my kind of people. You see people like who love business? My kind of people. Alright, so 
we're gonna be heading to a friend of mine. Every time I come down to have a shout shop, a friend of mine, her name is Salana, and I'm going to ask her, what is there to do in Beckway? If you come down to Beckway, what you should do? What are the few things that you cannot not do when you come to Beckway? Let's go find her. All right, so I found my friend Salana, and I just wanted to tell me, because she lives in Beckway, no, I don't want to fool the people that I come to a big person for telling me what is the five? I just want five. I know it's more than five, right? but I just want five things. So let me tell me, what are the five things that you have to do when you get to Beckway? Okay, Maurice. <laughs> Since my long-term friend here hasn't been to Beckway in a while, I, I can give him a little bit of ed education on Beckway. Five things you definitely have to do. One of my top favorite is you have to visit my Peggy Rock. If you have never been to Mount Peggy Rock, it's a must-see. Great climb. I have been to Mount Peggy. I'm fat and out of shape. It is a hard climb, but it's a good exercise. Continue. Two, you have to visit the Beckway Heritage Museum. It's under construction right now, but it's going to be fantastic to see in the future. Okay, that's something yeah. I have not seen, so I'm looking forward to that. Three, visit the Old Fort which is in Hamilton. It's very historic. There's a lot of history surrounding Beckway when it comes to the old fort. And if you didn't know, there were nine forts in Beckway, but that's one of the last remaining. Oh, wow. I did not know. Let's see where you have to come to the Beckway people. <laughs> All right. Four, the beaches. Like, if you haven't been to the beach, Maurice, you need to go. <laughs> like, Low Bay, Princess Margaret, Hope Beach, Ravine Bay, Friendship Bay, all the beaches in Beckway, you have to go and explore them. All right, then. What is the fifth one? Though? Fifth? Hmm, the churches, especially the Anakin Church. There's a lot of history in the Anakin Churchyard, and there's a lot of different churches on the island. There's the Catholic Church, which is also one of the oldest churches in the island. But the Anglican Church, I think, is one of the most beautiful churches on Beck where you have to visit. All right, then. So, the last thing now, the last thing I want to ask you. So, tell me now, if I come down to Beck when I walk and across the strip, come across there. When I see the sign Solana, why do I need to come and visit? Hello! Them? It's the number one place to shop in Beckway. Well, oh, no, don't on. let me say that. Because that is, no. Um, we're a wealth of information when it comes to Beckway. And we're hospitable. Come Beckway on. people are known for their charm and their personality and their friendliness. And I think we're one of the friendliest, friendliest stores on island. Okay. So you have to come, shop by Solana, and then she goes send you for go up, down, cross, however. Exactly. Exactly. And she goes, but you might even get some food. <laughs> and that too. <laughs> I hope I open for cross, make that cross, so I can get some food and it's done. Oh. All right. So that has been my chat with Solana on what are the five best things to do in Beckway. So we finished chatting with Solana. So the first stop we're going to be making is the property and friendship. We're going to give you a little outside view of the property. Tell you a little bit about it. It's a nice place. Potential for a nice little villa. Beautiful view of the ocean. I like it. I like it. Let's go. people so we have just shown you how to get to this property we're in the south side of Beckway down friendship side the nice side the cool side and we came to this property It's a lovely property now first thing let me apologize I'm not going to show you inside of the property because I need some love on the inside but the outside is a just a lovely lovely opportunity this property is sitting on 27,000 square feet of land. A whole heap of land. A whole heap of land. 
and the house itself is about close to 3,000 square feet of property. There are three bedrooms on the top floor, two bedrooms on the ground floor, the usual kitchen, dining, everything on both floors. Now this property, when I'm looking at this property, you have two options with this property. You can buy it if you want to just have a residential home, but also the second opportunity here is a nice place for a little villa. Why do I say it's a nice place for a villa? When you go on Beckway on the Google Maps and you look at the places around it, you have little villas close by and right in my background, right in my background, there's Beckway Beach Hotel. It's a lovely area. If you want to have an investment property that you could pick up this property and make it into a villa so you could rent it out and get some income. Trust me, I wish I had a villa in Mekwe. When I go on Airbnb and I see the prices these people charge per night, yo, we need Mekwe villas. And I'm certain if you purchase this property, you put some money inside of the inside to make it how you want it to be, then trust me, this could be making some very good income for you. So how much is this property value? Like? How much is this property? How much, how much is it? How much are we calling for 27,000 square foot of land? Almost 3,000 square foot of house. Stone wall finishes all around. Only 850,000 easy dollars. That is in Bekwe. Bekwe custom to US. That is a US. Bekwe is a US kind of island. Bekwe in St. Vincent. Bekwe they come Bekwe you have to know you have to call US. But we're talking EC. It's only 850,000 EC. So give me a shout if you're interested in this property. You want to find out more information. You want to take a view of this property. Just give me a call. 492-6128. That's for the lime and the flow people. And then did you sell and flow? They have some problems. They're not, you know, they have some problems with the, with the wiring. So I have a now a digital phone which is 527 The 6128 is similar, but just the 492 or the seven the, fa the 527 is different. Alright? So call me. Let's come down to Bekwe. Let me show you this property. Let me tell you about the potential. Go on Airbnb for yourself. Check out how much properties there is rented for and see the potential to buy this property and have a nice income property for you and your family. Alright, so we just came from the first stop or first property down on Friendship side and now we're heading on the north side. We're heading to a piece of land that is in Crown Point Beckway. Alright, so let me show you how to get to the property and then we'll tell you why this is an amazing opportunity for you to pick up this beautiful piece of land in Crown Point, Beckway. Let me go. Alright, so we just came back into the harbor. Now we're heading to the north side of the island to take you to Crown Point to show you this piece of land. So let me have a little drive and talk conversation now. Now I, it must be, some, it must be strange when I come across people in St. Vincent who tell me they never come to Beckway. I don't know, Beckway is one of my favorite, you know, when you're in school, you're going back to school and you're watching your to-do list and you say, boy, we need to go Beckway on a Sunday to just vibes with the family and refresh yourself before you go back to school. 
When anytime you have any long break or little holiday, Beckway is one of the places you have to come to just relax. When you bring people to 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 you know to St. Vincent, you bring people to Beckway, you go to the Total Sanctuary, like Solana said, you head up to the fort to take some nice photos. When you try to lose some weight, like how I try to lose some weight right now, you tackle my Peggy and drop some of that pounds. Trust me, Bekwe is just the place to be. You have the nice beaches. Let me tell you nice beaches. We head out to Lower Bay and it does vibes on the beach. Or you head to Princess Margaret. Trust me, you have to come to Bekwe. And for the people in St. Vincent, who say they never come back with people make all kinds of the freight boat, the this, the that. Catch a plane and come back with. Now, to get to Bekwe, we do there's no international airport in Bekwe, so you can fly directly into Bekwe. So the two ways that people get to Bekwe, they for one they can take a yacht and come into the harbor, or you come to St. Vincent. So if you're coming by plane, of course, you land in Argyle now and then you grab one of those small aircraft and you come down to Beckway. Or like I did today, you get on the boat, you enjoy a one hour ferry ride down to Beckway. You have two choices when it comes to ferries. You have Beckway Express and you have Admiral to come down to Beckway. So even if you ain't buying property, and you overseas and you're saying, boy, where do I go to have a vacation? Come to St. Vincent and do 32. I'm telling you, you cannot go wrong. St. Vincent is just amazing. There's so much to do. Anything you're into, we have it in St. Vincent when it comes to tourism. All right, so we're heading to the property. We're going up there and we're going to show you this amazing opportunity. For the Vincentians, if you're looking to have a little staycation, that is a big thing now right now in the Caribbean, instead of flying and going somewhere else for your anniversary or some special occasion, have a staycation. We just, just go on Airbnb. We find nice places in St. Vincent. We just book an Airbnb and go. And we call it a nice staycation. Sometimes we do a one night or we do a weekend support the local still support the local man have a staycation in, in, in Beckway or in uh, all, the, all, the, all the other islands in the lower Grenadines and really help St. Vincent grow because St. Vincent is the best tourist destination in the whole Caribbean tell them Mr. Property says so people so we are here at this land now hotspots in Beckway there are two upscale developments in Beckway you have Spring Estate and you have Crown Point now when you're looking for a nice place a nice quiet place to put your property these are the two places people go now I'm not going to tell you 
is only foreigners could afford to pay to, to buy these places. You have locals who are entrepreneurs because I bet we're full of entrepreneurial people. They could afford to come and buy this lot. Trust me. You know, you go down in the harbor and say, oh, this place for sale. And a man who have a nice little business come up and say, well, let me buy that property today. So this is not only for people who are retiring from overseas, but also the locals could afford to buy this plot. This plot is only 11 US dollars per square foot. It is 13,113 square foot in total. You have a nice over 10,000 square feet of, of, of land, so you could put a nice house on it and you have enough space for a yard. All right, so what is the highlights of this property? When you put a property on this land, as KB will show you when he does the drone shot and nice it up pretty, you have a nice view of the ocean. When you look at the houses that are around, they you have plenty of houses around, close, 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 but the houses that sprinkle across the development, excellent houses. So you know what that mean? We spoke about this in the episodes before. Value. Value. When you're buying land, you have to make sure you have a keen eye of the properties that are being constructed around you so that in the future you can make sure that your asset appreciates in value. So you're making an investment now, but you're keeping an eye out. What's going on around me? What is close by? And when you look at the okay, that house over there nice, this house over there nice, you know that in the future this property will appreciate in value. And that of course, the house itself might depreciate because you have to maintain it. But you book it and show that the property will increase in value because there are excellent properties around it and the land has been developed in such a way that it protects your investment. So, look at me. Look at me. Right now in the Caribbean, we have a Ponzi scheme going around right now. Everybody say bring one, bring two. I say buy land. All they want to go fire and water and all kind of petal story. No buy land land is a good investment and this property in crown point beckway beckway is a nice investment crown point is an excellent investment so you have two layers of good investment and this area in beckway is a lovely place to stake and call your own so call me people call me i have two numbers now 492-6128 if you have a if you have a digital number five to seven six one to eight let's come and see this land let's make a decision and of course mr property is the guy that you need to call to buy property and if you have a property in beckway let me look in the camera straight in the camera if you have a property in beckway call mr property so we could do some nice videos and things and market the thing the man we don't just take people property and just put it on website and do nothing with it we spend quality dollars marketing property in the diaspora outside of St. Vincent and inside of St. Vincent so when you get when we get your property we ensure that we invest in marketing to make sure that you get some movement and traction with that property so call me let us do some business all right so that's the property right there crown point call me let's buy this property take it off the market and let's make, I want to come back here another time and see this lovely house and say, boy, I just feel so proud when I pass land that I've sold in the past and I see people building some beautiful houses, starting their families and moving their families into these houses. It has moved my heart. So let my heart be moved again when I come to the, tur the turtle sanctuary and I look up on the hill and say, yo, I sell that house in the land day. So call me, let do business in Beckway. All right.
all right so mr property has shown you the two beautiful properties that we have listed in beckway but kb is going to now show you the beauty of beckway i keep saying over and over st vincent and the grenadines is one of the most beautiful countries in the caribbean even if you ain't buying property in st vincent you need to come and visit st vincent and all of his islands in the grenadines trust me so we're going to splice up everything in in beckway we're going to give you a beautiful view of what you are missing in beckway all right so for the people on the mainland who i know and people just tell me they have never come to beckway it is a shame and a disgrace you need to come down into the grenadines and see for yourself what beauty is in the grenadines staycations we say so come down if you see me on the beach don't bother me i relax and our vibes in on the white sand beach and that has been my friends 10 sweet episodes of caribbean dreams tv leave me let me just relax myself on the beaches of beckway just enjoy the footage of beckway call me if you need property and i might even say boy call me if you need a tour of beckway too if you need a tour of st vincent if you need me to tell you why you should be here out